of our lives fans know the drill by now. Do something horrible, tell a sad life story, fall in love, get forgiven. It's a pathway to character success that has been a Salem staple for decades. Don't believe us? Here are some examples, Ben, Xander, Kristen, Kate, Gabby, Ava, Nicole, Tripp, Claire, Gwen, Abigail, Sammy, Steve, Victor, we could go on and on and on and on. Today, we're asking almost 2,000 viewers whether you want Jan to follow the same route, nope, a landslide 93% of you shrug. Unlike all of the above, Jan is just too bad to redeem. Sure, she's killed multiple people like Ben and Abigail. And she's tried to steal another woman's man, like Sammy. And she faked a medical condition, like Kate. And she's a kidnapper, like Nicole and Kristen and Xander. But Jan is worse than all of them. So she needs to have the book thrown at her. No love and babies for her. A much, much smaller 5% doesn't want to see Jan redeem, but you don't want to see her going to jail, either. You want Jan to stick around Salem and keep causing trouble, but just enough to stir the pot, not enough to put her away. Every soap town needs a bad girl. You'd hate for Jan to hang up her scheming hat. In fact, 2% of the audience is looking forward to Jan's havoc. You want her torturing Belle and Sean indefinitely, but no need to stop with them. How about annoying Jack and Jennifer, especially now that it looks like Gwen has lost interest? Or Steve and Kayla. Goodness knows they could use a story. Days of Our Lives airs weekdays on NBC. Check your local listings for airtimes.